Okay, so I have a soft spot for the lion, okay? My husband is a Leo. I love him to death. He is also no exception. I love that Leos are pretty much the life of the party. They embrace life. They love life. They love to have a good time. I love that fun type of I need life to be interesting type of vibe. They like the best things in life. Most Leos are not gonna go small. They're gonna like really, really go big or go home. They're really, really good leaders. They are outstanding leaders. I know um, God bless his soul. Nipsey the Great was a, a Leo and he was a phenomenal leader. He was a great representation of a Leo and what leadership is about. There's so many things about the Leo that I enjoy, but there are always, of course, there's always a dark side to every light situation. <laughs> So because Leos love to go big or go home, they are very extravagant spenders. And I know in my case, I have def definitely dealt with this on a first-hand basis. Sometimes my husband will just go and buy things and he'll make really big purchases and he won't talk to me about it. He'll just do it and won't think about it. And that is a problem for me. Like when we go, even when we go shopping or go to the grocery store, he has to buy two of everything. And it's like, why do we need that many? Or why do we need that many bottles of ketchup? You know, we just need one because they like to show off and showy, showy, showy. They don't care what it costs, they're just gonna spend it. Leos can be very, very um, self-centered. Because remember, they are the lion. The lion is, you know, the king of the jungle. Uh, Leos are the sun sign, so the world goes around the sun, and that's how Leos are. They want their, they want you to give them a lot of credit. They want you to give them all the love, and they want you to revolve around them. Of course, evolved Leos, um, and my husband has definitely evolved. They learn how to put other people before them a little bit and they learn that it's not all about them you know and that's just how it goes and i feel like by me understanding him i get that when he gets like that they're also terrible at communicating like for instance with the whole money situation you know he'll go buy something and he won't communicate that with me and you know that could be a really really big issue and that's something that we've had to work on it's affected a lot of our um you know, our finances, of course, and, you know, communicating is really, really important, and Leo's just, they're just, they got to work on that. They got to work on that. I know I used to work with a lady that was a Leo. She was actually the owner of the business, and she would just, like, hide in her office, and she just wouldn't communicate things with me, and as an employee, you know, as someone that was working up under her, the fact that she didn't communicate with me caused a lot of big issues in, you know, of course, me working there. And I don't work there anymore simply because of her failure to communicate with me. She just, she just did not like communication. So, but I'm just going to leave it right here. I hope you guys really, really enjoyed this video. I am going to be doing so many more of these types of videos because I just love astrology. I just really do believe that astrology and how the the stars and the sun and the planets were aligned when you were born has a lot to do with the type of person you are, the type of people that you associate with, um, the type of career you choose, the type of mate that you choose. You know, of course, a lot of the influence that the influences that you grew up around, whether it be in a bad influence or the way you were raised, has a lot to do with you being the type of person you are as well. But I just feel like when we are equipped to know who we really, really are, we will know, we will have the tools to make ourselves better. And that's what this type of thing is about. So I hope you guys really, really enjoyed this video. Please leave some comments below. Please like the video. I want you to like the video so that you can just show YouTube that this is what you want to look at. I will see you guys on the next video. And remember, there is no change without challenge. And I will see you guys again soon.